What is going on everyone and welcome to our weekly series of the Night Vendor Roll series. So this week we have an event going on and basically what it is is when you do Night Vendor Rolls it's uh, half energy so instead of 50 it's 25 and when you get uh, boss gear and accessories and stuff that's also at a discounted price. So yeah uh, we're going to be doing a few more of these a week for the next two weeks because of the event and usually it's like a one a week kind of thing but i'm going to try my best to you know like log on to my other characters while i'm afk usually i just kind of let energy build up through time and we do it once a week but since the event is actually half off and things are cheaper now is a good time for everyone um to be just like trying to roll and you know just do your best to get the boss weapons you want so before we do anything, um, hopefully you guys are enjoying the series. You can always uh, check the link in the description to the playlist. Uh, we have quite a few parts so far, and you guys can see basically how I get my boss gear and a lot of stuff. So, with that said, we have about, I would say, throughout all of our characters, probably 150 rolls, basically doubled. And that's pretty sweet. So what we are looking for, of course, is a... Uh, cheap dagger, kudum Nuver for Witch Wizard, Ranger, and a Cestus for, what is it, Mystic, and of course a uh, Guard Brace, I think that's what it's called, a Van Brace, Guard Brace, whatever, a Nuver or Kudum, preferably a Nuver. Uh, I don't really want Kudums of anything, but if we can get it, that'd be great. All right, so it should be like half off, yeah. Um, the only things that are changed in price are like boss gear, accessories, uh, everything else like black stones are all going to be the same price as usual. So let's hope for the best. Now is also a good time to stock up on black stones if you need it too. So hopefully this will last you a long time because we're definitely going to be enhancing in the near future. Oh boy. That's a lot of black stones. Oh yeah, before we uh, dump everything into storage, I am going to... Um, what is it? Uh, we'll tally everything up, because you guys apparently like seeing that. Uh, I got some requests in the previous episodes of like showing the totals of everything. And unfortunately, I can't just take out all my stuff, so let's see. We're at 904 black stones right now with 131 sharps, 385 hards, and 600 weapon stones. Um, we'll see what the total is at the end. What really matters is the black stones because that's the fun one to track. Okay. Oh, we got two more of these, actually. Okay, next character... I just want to see some cheap weapons. Uh, if we could get a bags glove for under 70 mil, I might consider it, but that's not high on my priority list right now. Um, what we just want is mostly these because I got mine to Tet the gauntlet. I just need the other two pieces. Uh, I did sell my Sissel necklace for like 1.1 billion and that's where most of my money comes from. Alrighty, let's keep rolling. Sharps are always good. Blackstones are good. I wonder if they dropped the rate of... Ooh, are these worth it? I don't know. Let's buy it anyway. Griffin Helmet was our first boss piece we've seen at 117 mil. Um, to be honest, you could probably get it on pre-order for about like 120-ish or 117. So I would say this is a solid price if you don't need it. Fortunately, I already have two of them. So uh, yeah, we don't need it. So as you may imagine... We are going to have lots of black stones at the end of this. 
I'll try to get hopefully two a week for these kind of videos. Let me see before we do anything. How much our market shadow is going for? Uh, about seven Ishmael. I know these will sell instantly. So about like I think I could list it for seven point one and have it sell recent or relatively fast. It's probably profit. Also, since the rolls are going to be doubled in time, I'll try to speed things up and not waste your time either. And this is the class where I needed the dagger because those tets and a scuffed plus nine. What a time. All right. Anyway. I wonder if they lowered the drop rate for boss gear just because of this event. Either that or I'm just really uh, not seeing anything. Some days or some weeks I just see things back to back boss gear. Some weeks I don't see anything. Three characters are already uh, full on that. Uh, I'll do the lawn last if we have time. It's only four rolls, but I gotta get through the important ones with a lot of energy. Sharps will always be good. Ooh, an ogre for 190. That is actually not the worst thing I've seen, but it's not great. That was actually pretty bad. Crescent for 21. Hell yeah, we're buying that. Though I think now that the event is going on, um, I'm pretty sure my Crescent will sell. But a lot of people are also doing Night Vendor during this event, so it might not sell in 10 minutes. It might take a few hours, but I'm pretty sure it can. All right, let's list this. I definitely don't need that right now. Good, good. Uh, we made some money back. Seeing accessories is great. I would like to see some actual boss weapons, though. Oh, God. I need that, but I don't really want to pay 186 either. Uh, sadly, I'm going to have to pass on this because I just want a new verse straight up. If I could get another Dandy Vedian, that one is for the Dark Knight, I 
I'm probably going to do that if it's a reasonable price. Simply because eventually I'm going to start going for pen and I am not about to blow up my main gear. So I've always been the kind of person who believed in going for backups even with accessories. So it may cost more in the long run, but I think it's worth it. Because it would make me not want to quit the game when everything blows up. So, yeah. The day I go for pen, I'm going to have a backup. Even if it sets me back a few more weeks just to get it. Ooh, sharp bundles. Another mark of shadow. Uh, this one is not too bad. We got a sharp bundle, so that's great. And I assume this is your chance now to stock up on enhanced materials, so be sure to do that. Somehow I don't think these uh, marks are going to sell um, like too quickly because if I'm getting this many, so are other people and it's going to flood the market. So I might just blow them up. Who knows? I don't know what I'm going to do with them. They're four mil each. If they sell, that's profit. If not, then I just hold on to them. This is what I thought was fun about May was well you just get infinite dashes more or less. That is the most disgusting price I've ever seen. I don't really need the hards, but they're cheap enough for me to buy. And you can always fail stack on them like so what you do with them if you aren't going for your high tier stuff is fail stack on them from like 15 to 26 or something oh we're almost at 400 well actually we're above 400 if we count everything uh, it was actually a hard decision when I was uh, trying to pick out whether I wanted to play Striker or Mystic. Turns out, Striker is clunky. It does more damage, yeah, but, I mean, rather play Mystic. Okay. I'm actually kind of surprised I haven't seen too many actual boss pieces. Why jump? Oh my god. Hey, 400. I don't even, like, I'm pretty sure 400 is enough to even get you a pen if you had enough mem frags for it. For me personally, and I'm sure a lot of other people who play this game, like, a lot, uh, you don't really need hards and sharps as much. It's more the memfrags that are bottleneck for everyone. And I wish they did sell memfrags on a Nightbender. Even if it was like 1 million a piece, I'd probably buy them.
Yeah, I'm convinced they lowered the rate that you see weapons and stuff. Though, now that I think about it, with this event, it's going to be putting more black stones into the economy for everyone. So that's pretty sweet. Stock up now. You have two weeks, which is actually a long time. And our market's going to be flooded with um, black stones. So, I guess that means for us, we get to do more enhancing. Because we're actually close to the point where I did actually plan on enhancing stuff. I think uh, 150 sharp should be able to get me at least two tets from zero, or like from pry at least. But you never know, I've seen people fail tet attempts a lot. Didn't I start with 1.5? Dang, money's going down. That's not worth it, by the way. I might as well just start using my maze and keeping them on cooldown. Let me see. Yeah, we have four characters left. That's uh, about 30-something rolls. Alrighty, we got this, I believe. We're actually doing really bad in terms of like boss weapons. We're just getting straight black stones, which, I mean, I'm okay with. But I would like to, you know, buy something that I really want. I don't know if these are worth buying at the moment because everyone else is getting them. Yeah, I mean, I probably could profit off of it, but it's just like, I don't know. They're only going to be going down in price. Nah. No! No! Uh, I don't know when the last energy tick was, but we could probably wait and get another energy tick. We could just buy the energy. not really recommend doing this.
Ooh, that was a lot of <laughs> maids. That 89 stack, I think I'm just going to go for pen for from now on. I mean, it seems kind of low where people are just hitting 100 stacks left and right, but I don't know. I just need a pen stack, so that's what we're going to be using. Well, the three-minute mark just ticked, and it hit on this character, so that's not bad. Oh boy, another crescent ring for cheap price. What in the hell? Lawn dandy for 360? Absolutely not. I don't think I'd pay 360 for any base dandy. We got another cheap crescent, but it's probably going to be a while till it sells. But I know it will sell at some point. Just who knows when. Worst comes the worst, we just smash them together. Alright, so last two characters. Let's get an ochre ring for like 50 mil. I'll buy it. I think we spent over 200 mil. Just a night vendor. It's kind of lo oh well. That's not a great price, but if I needed it, I'd probably pay that much. I know I said I wanted a Vediant, but I also said I wouldn't spend almost 400 mil on any dandy. So at base, if it was maybe like 194, maybe. So I think we have two more characters, or this could be the last one. Yeah, or... Yeah, we have time for this, plus a lawn. But the lawn only gets four rolls, and it's out in Grana, so... Eh. But I want to try to do at least two night vendor roll sessions a week, instead of one. Uh, only during this event, then I'll go back to regular schedule. Because I think we made some money. I actually don't know. We probably lost more money than we gained, but it's okay. Oh, God. Oh, my goodness. A third crescent for, like, half the price. Very worth You may think that's lucky. And it is, but I don't think we're profiting at all. We'd have to like liquidate a lot of random stuff. Well, we broke the four or 150 mark and then the 400 mark, so that's an accomplishment. Every time I see it, this number is going to go up. All right, uh, let me see. Our last character that we have energy to roll on is our lawn and that's only like four rolls so it's not a big deal if we can get something cheap then cool if not it's just another day
We got about an hour till Zarka spawns, so cool stuff. I don't even know how much money I have in Grana. It's not a lot. Okay. It's enough to get us, like... We're gonna have to go back and forth. Do I have any, like... Hold on. Do I have anything in, in my market that I could just get some money out of? I think so. Look at those crescents. Oh snap, some dudes paid winning their uh, tet attempts. Ugh, it's kind of disgusting actually. And now's a good time to start enhancing crescents if you need a tet one, which I will at some point in my life. Alright, so with that said, I think we are done. That was a lot of rolls. I definitely spent more money on black stones than I think I ever have in the past, like, six months. So, yeah. So let's calculate our totals while we're walking back. Um, so we got 15, 5 of those. Uh, we'll add it to our collection at some point because I have to transfer it over. But we started with 900 uh, black stones. I don't really remember. I think we got, like, something about 20 sharps and I don't know. I don't even know how many hards we got, but we got about 50 or I think a little bit more than 50 weapon stones, um, about 450 armor stones. We got a lot of crescents, which is good. And we got about 20 black crystal or sharps. And then I'm not really sure how many of these we got. Uh, unfortunately throughout all our rolls, we didn't get any actual boss gear that we or was pretty cheap but we got some accessories which is pretty solid um, with that said we'll try to get another video out soon I can't guarantee a date but it's just more like whenever I have time to just AFK on characters and then bring my energy up on all of them so with that said I will see you guys later have a fantastic day I know this is a longer video than usual but Hopefully it was exciting for you. See you guys again uh, within the next few days.